Andy Hill is fit again to resume at right back and that frees Ian Brightwell to move back into midfield. Davis for Anders Limpar who broke his jaw at Luton is the only change in personnel from the team which gave what George Graham called Arsenal's worst display of the season. Way back by Wright. Smith allowed to head it down, Merson hits it well! And it just veered away. To the considerable relief of Manchester City and Tony Coton in particular. Quick, Heath coming infield, he's got White ahead of him. Heath goes on as he made something for himself here. Adrian Heath now has to cross it and can't pull the ball back. <laughs> Quinn. It'll come for Quinn again. And he's frustrated. 20 minutes to go to half-time. Carroll with a quickish free kick. And Brightwell! Ian Brightwell's only goal for City this season came at Arsenal back in August. Smith. And Ian Wright has put it wide. Curl was complaining. But a hand was used, and from that angle, of course, it's quite clear what the complaint was for. As Quinn tries to supply the cross. Great work by Reid. Great get to Manchester City. They set it up for Redmond, and Dixon's only a yard away, Redmond has another go! Right. Now a chance for Dixon to hit in the early cross. Oh, and it was a header by Bold at the far post. Possibly with a shove along the way, and I don't think it would have counted. Winterburn. Good play from George Graham's team. And right. That's good play from Heath. Quinn allowed to turn. Heath goes again. And uh, Dixon saw the threat straight away. Hughes having to tuck in a bit to get into the game. It's a superb run. What about this from Michael Hughes? Oh. Poynton and Seaman covered it as it was veering inside the post but they're standing all around the ground to applaud Michael Hughes and I'm afraid amongst the spectators here was Niall Quinn in sheer admiration because after Hughes's run which looked to lead to glory was stopped there Quinn was flat on his heels and uh, Arsenal are playing their part Winterburn Goes for goal. Hughes. Reads there for the simple pass. Brightwell. Quinn. Hoping to get it down for White. It'll come for David White now. Can he keep the run going? He has done. David White has been dynamite for Manchester City and he's exploded again in the face of Arsenal this time it was a messy goal really but Manchester City won't mind that Quinn tried to get it through first of all in the end it ran off Dixon and White was fast enough, alert enough to fire it past Seaman 19 minutes to go City are in front and White scores for the sixth consecutive game and Hughes and White are both onside and Hughes has got to it and he's brought down and Andy Linegan is in serious trouble here it looks ominous for Linegan he's off Arsenal's post-Christmas depression hits a new low. Manchester City really revelling in the holiday season 
You can't say the same about George Graham and Arsenal. But David White has scored four goals in the last eight days. He's now scored for six matches in a row. But Manchester City, just one defeat now in their last 12 games. Manchester City won, Arsenal nil. Quinny seemed to uh, try to lay off first time. Uh, and he's battled away superbly. And I think they appeal for the offside, but as you see, these uh, tactically come off two Arsenal players. They managed to just get the right side of the defender and took it away there, which was superb, really. I'm very pleased with that.